My major area of research is the philosophy of art encompassing, uh, among other things, literature, drama, dance, film, uh, video, painting, sculpture, architecture. I try to cover the waterfront. My uh, weakest area, though, is, is music. In terms of my approach to the philosophy of art, I would say that my general agenda has to do with uh, challenging um, views that are, are not always explicit in the philosophical tradition, but are deeply embedded in it. Uh, views that art is autonomous from other realms of the culture. Uh, and and uh, for that reason, for example, uh, art is thought to be uh, outside the area of, of politics, religion, spiritual affairs, morality. Uh, and a great deal of my work is dedicated to trying to uh, within the philosophy of art, find the resources to dissolve those kind of boundaries. Uh, I also work in the individual arts. Uh, I've worked in uh, the philosophy of motion pictures, for example, uh, where I've uh, tried uh, again to uh, uh, challenge a kind of foundationalist view kind of notion that one could have a, a, a theory of film that more or less could answer every question that you might have uh, about the uh, medium of the moving image, including uh, the idea that there might be some, some grand theory. Uh, notably, uh, uh, I've uh, tilted against the post-structuralist uh, uh, Lacanian psychoanalytic grand theory of film, but also uh, earlier theories that thought of film as having a, a, an essential characteristic. Both of these theories uh, proposing uh, uh, views that would more or less cover every kind of question we would have about film. In contrast, I've offered a more pluralistic approach and one that has taken advantage of um, advances, for example, in the philosophy of mind and uh, cognitive sciences in terms of uh, research into the uh, emotions. I've just finished a book called Humor, a very short introduction. Uh, and I have uh, a couple of mopping up operations, so to speak, uh, a after that, uh, a few articles and a, a book on the philosophy of Arthur Danto that uh, is, is almost near completion. And once I clear my desk, I think my next project will be uh, to cover uh, the relationship of art, morality, and, and, and politics. I hope to be giving uh, a course in that in the near future, and I hope that that will pave the way to the uh, um, completion of a monograph on the subject. I, I, do, I do try to encourage uh, enrollment in all, all my courses from uh, uh, the cinema program, from uh, the fine arts program, literature, uh, and since one of my side interests is, is the philosophy of history, I also try to encourage uh, f students in those areas uh, to uh, uh, take, take my uh, courses. Um, and, uh, uh, you know, uh, the center uh, here is very rich in um, uh, opportunities for attendance to symposium and lectures from multiple uh, areas, and I, I, I benefit uh, from that a great deal. Uh, I also have to say that internal uh, to our own program, uh, there's, a, there's a great deal of in interdisciplinarity that I uh, profit from uh, immensely. Uh, I uh, uh, have colleagues who uh, are specialists in many fields different than my own, but uh, the conversation with them has really enriched my own research uh, to a terrific degree. Uh, Jesse Prince in the, in the philosophy of mind, uh, um, Peter Godfrey Smith in ev evolutionary theory, uh, Stephen Neal in the philosophy of, of, of language. Long, long range, I hope, by the way, to uh, after the uh, art and morality book, uh, I have a, a long range aim of writing a, a philosophy of narrative and the real concentration in, in language, the philosophy of language and uh, the knowledge of linguistics in this department uh, is really, really going to be of vast assistance in that regard. I'm going into my sixth year at the Graduate Center. Uh, as I've already said, one of the great 
uh, advantages of the Graduate Center of my, of my colleagues here as, as, especially, from whom I've uh, derived a, a great deal. I've had the opportunity to uh, attend their classes. We ex exchange, exchange papers. Uh, uh, I've team taught uh, uh, classes with, with some colleagues, and I, I found this to be one of the most uh, uh, stimulating and richest intellectual communities. Uh, the students as well are a, a real source of um, in inspiration and, and, and feedback. Uh, I find the, the, the students here to be uh, a exceptionally conscientious and, and, and well-trained, very articulate. Uh, I don't want to make them sound uh, too austere, though. They all uh, have uh, very, very winning uh, personalities and, and good sense of humor, but uh, these are really uh, an extremely well turned out bunch of uh, uh, students to work with. Uh, and of course, one advantage of the Graduate Center, it goes without saying, is uh, New York City, especially for anyone interested in the arts or aesthetics. It is, uh, in, 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 in many areas, uh, dance, music, uh, fine arts, uh, the, the center of Western world.